For uh, oh, about the 30 years or now, uh, so that we've been here on PSL, we do focus on the people and places of the Quad Cities area. And now comes a YouTube channel with the goal of showing what it's like to live here. Alex Skeen is a content creator and realtor and the creator of Living in the Quad City. So you go on your YouTube channel and then you look at these videos and you have yep. a complete profile picture That's right. of life in the quads. That's what I try to do, that's for sure. How accurate do you think it is, Alex? I try to be as accurate as possible. I, you know, I do it mm -hmm. to try to let people know what it's like from outside the Quad Cities. Mm -hmm. So I try to give them the good and the bad. I mm -hmm. don't know if you know, a lot of people don't like winter. That's one thing that I let people know about yeah. because, you know, That's if you're funny. coming from Phoenix, you may not know that. Right. You're coming from Phoenix, <laughs> you're going to move here. Usually it's the opposite. Right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, okay. Let's look at your little camera. Yeah. So this, this is what makes it happen. That's you right. With your little, little dead microphone. Mic. Yes. Mm -hmm. Got a screen there. You might see the background there. Yeah. But, so uh, this is what you shoot everything on this little guy. Yeah. So I started out actually with just my smartphone. Mm -hmm. And this is kind of a recent upgrade, got this camera going, just to try to make it a little better quality for people mm -hmm. seeing what the Quad Cities looks like. Mm -hmm. So, Can you yeah. see, in the, see, so this, so right now he is shooting some of our studio, yeah. right? So we just have it pointed like that. So this is, this is all you need yep. to make it happen. Yep, pretty much. I got a couple other tripods, but that's about it. Well, let's let's see some of the products. So, so yeah. we have some video we're, we're, we're going to roll here. So, so you go through and you just kind of like there you are at Leclerc Park. Yep. And then yep. you do do narr you narrate most of this stuff. Yeah, yeah. So I'm usually talking about what I'm seeing, what mm -hmm. the neighborhoods are like, you know, what downtown's like, just giving a per first person perspective of what it actually mm -hmm. is like to live in the Quad Cities. Mm -hmm. You can see there I was at the Sky Bridge. You got Lago Marcinos there. Do we have you audio know. on this, you guys? This one do, I do don't think. Do we have audio? Think. Can listen to? Do you, yeah. No, we don't. Okay. This one so I don't. You just think narrate, those. Alex. You you narrate yeah, yeah. it live. Do yeah. it live. So that one was uh, Chris Kringle, I think is what it's called. Yes, yes, um, right. Chris Chris Kendall Market. Yeah. Yes, uh huh. Right there, I was talking about Duck Creek and where you're thinking about moving next to Duck Creek. You want to make sure it's not going to flood. Where's this? Just that's uh, that's actually at the Figgy. Right, is it so now? So that was one of their exhibits. I think about a year ago the now. The corn lights. Yeah. yeah. So it's kind of cool. So how, how are like. you spreading out? Yeah, you know, I see a lot of uh, immediate Quad City stuff. Do you mm -hmm. go out, kind of out? Yeah, uh, so I outskirts? try to hit like Eldridge, some of those small towns mm -hmm. outside, just to give people a little more perspective. Most of my stuff is obviously right in the Quad Cities because that's where I'm at and it's easier mm -hmm. to get to. Because it does take some time to pick up some of these videos as we're going around. So your goal was to, to show life here mm -hmm. and uh, for your realty business, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, you know, my backstory is I moved here in 2015. I was a mechanical engineer for Alcoa. Um, when I moved here, I didn't know what to look for. You know, there wasn't a lot online at that time in 2015. Mm -hmm. I got my license when I was there. I worked there for six years and full, fully made the transition. And that time I was like, why not make a video or a YouTube platform to let people know what it is like to live in the Quad Cities? Do you find that this has worked for you? I have. Yeah, it's crazy how many people will reach out to me. I've had people reach out from Malaysia, Brazil, South Africa, and then pretty much every state in the Union. Well, I believe it because, you know, the world is on YouTube. Yes. And so you can look up really any place in the world and yep. there are YouTube videos about it. Yes. And so is there any competition for the Quad Cities? Uh, uh, are there others who have posted things on? Not, not a ton. Okay. There's a few others in the state of Iowa that I know about, but Quad Cities, there's really nobody making a lot of content for it. Mm -hmm. so. and would you say it's mainly a travel log? I mean, I, I saw that you hit kind of, a, a, I wouldn't say necessarily touristy places, but where to eat and drink and have fun. Mm -hmm. and, um, and then where's the stuff where you show things that you think are negative? It's usually talking head stuff. So, you know, where I talk about the pros and cons of living in Davenport, that's more of just me speaking right directly to a camera. Okay. And then I'll have stuff in the background just kind of showing what I'm talking about. And I'll do neighborhood tours as well so mm -hmm. people know what the neighborhoods look like and everything around the game. Do you there. ever catch any, any backlash for uh, saying something that um, someone disagrees with? Do you ever get any of that? I do once in a while. You're I not mean, afraid to express something that's maybe negative? No. And the way I look at my channel is kind of like an Amazon review of the Quad Cities. Okay. You want people to know exactly what they're getting into when they're moving here, the good and the bad. And honestly, most people appreciate me saying what the bad things are, even though it's hard for me to actually come up with any bad things, to be yeah, honest no, with you. Yeah, no, you're right. You're right. But, but, but it's, uh, it's personal opinion. Exactly. So whenever, I mean, 
we all disagree on some things in yes. life. So yes. yes. So you Absolutely. might say, oh, you love this place, and somebody else is going, I don't like that place at all. Exactly. Whatever. Yep. Um, so you're you're covering uh, both sides of the river. Yes. Yes. Yep. Always. Um, so uh, to learn about living in the Quad Cities, look <laughs> at that. Living in the Quad Cities TV is the YouTube channel. So if you want to check out, do you, is, you separate these out, Alice? How many different videos do you have on the? I think I have on about. I think I have about 75 videos you now. You do? Yeah. 75. Um, we're approaching about 700 subscribers. So pretty excited about that. That is very cool for you. Yeah. So, um, so you don't necessarily make any money off of this part. Nope. No. Um, usually, when people, I have my phone number on there, so people call me for the real estate needs. But again, that's a part of it. But it's also letting people know what it is because a lot of people will move here not necessarily wanting to buy a house. They always want to rent or you know get mm -hmm. a feel for it. Mm -hmm. um, I had a couple actually stop me in Walmart the other day. They asked me if I was on YouTube. They recognized you. They oh, did. That's great. They actually. <laughs> came from Alaska and moved here because of my videos and they're just renting for now and getting used to the Quad Cities. But That's a heck of a story right there. Yeah, it's pretty interesting. Right? You ran into somebody at Walmart who recognized yep. you yeah. and they moved from Alaska here because yep. of your videos. Yep. Wow. And that's yeah. what they told me, which is shocking to me, because I'm just making videos, you know, it doesn't it feel like it. has to be real, or they wouldn't have known who you are. Yeah. Yeah. So the pressure's on, Alex. Oh, yeah. But yes, well, <laughs> welcome to the life. But this Thank is you. pretty cool. This is, this is very fun, and this is all you yeah. need. This exactly. is all you need, that, and the Pretty YouTube simple. channel, you got it made. Um, right. Alex, uh, thanks for what you do. That's, that's, that's a fun thing, and it yeah. was neat to hear about it. So, Thank you so uh, all much. All the best to you. Thank you.